Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Game Boys. Today we're going to be talking about the PlayStation Summer Sale. We have 473 matches in the search engine and we're going to go through every single one. Hey guys, this is William Henderson here with my co-host George Ferrito. Aloha. How are you, buddy? Fantastic. I think I'm going to lean into that Hawaiian thing. I'm going to just start saying aloha. You mahalo. should. Dude, what if you're 23 and me results come back and you're not Hawaiian at all? I'm not going to tell anybody. <laughs> <laughs> no one's going to know. I've been leaning into it too hard. They're like, you're Chinese. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Actually, my birth certificate says I'm Chinese. Really? It does. That's weird. But I'm not. Why does it say that? My mom people thought she are racist. Was. My mom thought she was part Chinese. Wow, that's fucked up. Yeah. So can you get that changed? Like I, altered? I'm not gonna. <laughs> it says so. What if they start rounding up Chinese people? Well, I mean, Jap- Japanese people are going to get looped into that anyway, you know? Touche. And let's be they, re- yeah, Trump can't tell the difference. <laughs> so, And ch- the Chinese are going to rule the world eventually, so I'm just going to leave it on there for that purpose. Yeah. Just for safety. I, I hope they do, because if they just are contained within the confines of china i think they'll just be living on top of each other like china will just be a mound of people <laughs> at one some point wow like, that would be a lot of people in like 1300 years it's just <laughs> <laughs> regular like dead planet earth and then when yeah. you get to china it just looks like coruscant from the sky it's like is this <laughs> one big city it's like that south park episode where all the dudes are having gay orgies you know <laughs> just in a pile everybody's just squirming around and they just keep reproducing because they just keep rubbing up against each other and fucking that's my kind of place yeah dude it's just <laughs> It's a vicious cycle. You Starts know? fires. There's so much rubbing. <laughs> <laughs> so much friction. Yeah. Yep. Everyone's so tense. Yeah. Um, have you seen Serenity or uh, Firefly? No. Joss Whedon show. It's like a a post-apocalyptic like space cowboy, but based on Earth kind of story. But mm. that premise is that everyone knows English and Chinese because America and China eventually w- ruled the planet. <sighs> I don't think we would, we would, I don't know, rule the planet. Why? I don't think we're far from it. We don't, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but the like only a, reason officially we, though? The only reason we don't is because a lot of people would get mad if we turned certain places into a parking lot. Yeah. But somewhere deep down in <laughs> the, the good old fashioned American blood, we're like, no, I want everything. I want it all. I mean, yeah, <laughs> you're not I've wrong. I've just talked you into world domination. Yeah. This is how this is how it starts. <laughs> this is how you start a cult <clears throat> in a garage. Dude, it'd be so crazy if somebody was a dude. <clears throat> you know, what's weird is like, I don't think a lot of people realize how close Hitler was to taking over the world. Yeah. He made some big mistakes that if he would have changed those things up, then like he could have done it. What would the world be like? now though everybody's speaking german <laughs> there's um there's a comic book like alternate universe um where hitler did win and like it's a, a german regime all the way through so there's evil superman that's like got a third reich in, instead of an s on mm. his chest it's very dark very interesting very grim yeah i feel like there was there was rumor of like a tv show that was going to be like that Probably. Dude, everything's been delayed indefinitely yeah, that's as true. of today. <laughs> Mulan and I know. Uh, they had me with ninjas, so right. I'm in. Yeah. Yeah. So I I'm his co host. Welcome. That was my yeah. intro. <laughs> uh, <laughs> hi. Welcome to our quarantine podcast. Um I do apologize for not having more episodes up because it's like what's it's Murphy's Law. <laughs> if it can go wrong it will and it has it does multiple times already so 
hopefully this one is uh, live and kicking. So it'll be fine. It's all gonna go well. The levels are right. Yeah, we the checked pre- everything. The pre-recordings were good. <laughs> yeah. Our our assistants came in an hour before we got here and just pre-ran everything. So uh, yeah, thanks uh, guys in the back. Thank you. We appreciate you. Because we have immensely. we definitely have assistance yeah we um, are successful hey can we get some coffee over we, here <laughs> please yeah 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 just two cups yeah let's do, yeah <laughs> yeah it's summertime well summer I, when is how long ago did summer start uh what's the date july i don't know <laughs> <laughs> i think it's in june sometime like june 22nd or some bullshit like that mm. that's my bet look it up it's a little late for a sale and you know, it's still summer, dude. True. But Plus, they did days of play. I think it was last month, or no, it was longer ago than that. But everything's a big blur. Yeah. Sometimes. Yeah. But I just, I feel like this sale is, like I said, I don't want to buy any of them. There's great games on the list, but PlayStation Five is right there. I know, but it's right there. Is it? Yeah. It's right there. We know what it looks like. We've all agreed five hundred dollars is about the most what most of us are gonna I'm, pay. I'm not getting it unless I get another stimulus check. Mm, that's fair. That's the responsible thing to do. Then I guess you have to come over. You I know? guess like, so, yeah. What a damn shame. <laughs> I'm like Barbie, I buy my friends. <laughs> come play with my stuff. That's very uh eighties, nineties, you know, like, no, we gotta go, he's got the new Super Nintendo. Right. Right. I miss that. Yeah, it was fun. Yeah. Dude, I, re- I watched... Um, have you seen West Side Story? mm I watched it recently, and there's a scene where they, they're they like, yeah, we're going to talk about the rumble of, like, the other gang. You know, they're, they're going to have a sit-down and meet up to discuss weapons. And <laughs> so they're like, yeah, where are we going to meet? <laughs> the candy store. <laughs> 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 like... What? what? They and they meet at the candy store and they hang out there like it's a bar. It's the really candy weird. Man can. It's a weird like they had soda, dude. Yeah, yeah. You you went out after school, I guess, to go get a pop. Imagine you'd have to go to a candy store to get a soda. Fuck, I'd be. I probably wouldn't I'd drink soda. I'd be skinny. <clears throat> uh, yeah, I'd be yeah. like, I'm not going to a candy store as an adult. No. <laughs> But I mean, these adults did. These fucking that's fair vagrants did hang out there. Yeah, vagrants. That's like, so weird. Yeah, that is very strange. <laughs> and a candy imagine, store. dude. I imagine it's. <laughs> I imagine it's like in um, Willy Wonka, where the Candyman sings the song and the kids all leave, and then those guys come in to that <laughs> same place, <laughs> and the and the guy just completely shifts characters, and he's like, "Hey, what's going on, guys?" <laughs> Over he's, there in the corner. He's like their fucking like ringleader or whatever he's like he's, he's like master. the mob boss yeah i mean well the owner did he was kind of like hey just uh, clean up when you're done like w- this is your place dude kick him out like you're trying to close he gets a cut of any of their fucking sh- <laughs> it's like now their that you mention it, it's, it's not that's probably what's going on <laughs> yeah right because he was just like you're just uh, stop making a mess <laughs> like he couldn't say anything but is that what happened store. in the movie? Kind of. Oh. He was very like nonchalant. Like they hang out there all the time, but he was about to close. Mm. And so he was just like, well, you kids be good. <laughs> it's like, dude, you can tell him no. Right. Whatever. It's odd. But I mean, Blackface was okay there too. So you should watch it. It's a great um, what is, what's, what's West Side story? story. Yeah. Is it a movie? Yeah. yeah. Mm. It's it's a... <laughs> It's a good glimpse into the past, I guess. There's just blatant onset slash on camera sexual harassment. Oh. <laughs> it's like, hey man, you can't just do that. Yeah. <laughs> but like a dude the eighties, you know. A dude legit Was it the an eighties? Like movie? the seventies. Holy shit. Yeah. A dude legit like just smacks a girl in the ass. Like mm. not even contextually part of the scene or anything. Right. Just like, oh smack. This is what we do here. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Very weird. Classic, though. Classic Shakespearean tale. Is it really? Of forbidden love, yeah. Huh. That Romeo oh, okay. and Juliet kind of thing. Interesting. Wrong dude falls in love with other dude's sister who's in a different gang, blah, blah, blah. Hmm. We're too young, make bad decisions. I think you just talked me out of it. Gun, gun, bang, bang. <laughs> All right, I'm back in. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> you said special effects? Oh, I'm in. <laughs> I'm in. I'm in. Gun, gun, bang, bang. <laughs> Um, special effects were fun in uh, this next game's movie. Assassin's Creed Unity is on sale, and I contemplated buying it despite really? despite there not being ninjas. Dude, the way you go after Assassin's Creed, I can't believe that statement just came out of your mouth. Yeah. What I'm upset about is like they have Star War- the Fallen Order Star Wars game, and it's still thirty dollars. That hurts, like, guys. Dude, that's probably just a, a Lucas Arts thing. <laughs> Probably. It's probably just contractually there. Like, we can't give it to you any less than this. Right. George right. gets mad. <laughs> <laughs> um, Spider Man for 20 bucks. That's cool. That's <clears throat> that's just the base, though, right? That's just the game, game of, of the year, year edition. Yeah, yeah. So you're, you're still going to buy everything else. Fucking you can whatever, dude. You can get the other one that's like $30 more expensive for everything. Oh, 30 extra dollars just for some bullshit. It's cool. They keep updating it. DLCs? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Like, give them more suits and shit. Right. It's super dope. FIFA twelve dollars, FIFA twenty. Mm-hmm. That's a good fucking deal. That's um right in third world price right there. So <laughs> everyone in Libya can now buy FIFA. Yeah, I just whoop your ass. <laughs> yeah, it's like whoa, dude. <laughs> do you guys just play this all day? <laughs> yes, uh, dude. Outside. Yeah, online sports games. I, I, I that's like. I'm, I shy away from the 2K online play because I'm like, dude, these guys are just going to go right around me and just embarrass me for 20 straight minutes. And I don't need that in my life right now. I'm trying to be a superstar. Yeah. And it's like, dude, did you get the game when it came out? I don't understand how people can be that good at something. I don't know either, man. I really don't get it. I'm not that good at anything. No game. Not nothing. Not, nothing. Yeah, I've you're been accurate. breathing yeah. my whole life <laughs> and I still choke daily. <laughs> These dudes are masters. I'm like, I don't, you, this isn't even fun. For, is it fun for you, sir? Because it can't be. It can't be even remotely fun for it's you. It's just right what now. they do. <laughs> yeah, there's some dudes on Call of Duty like that. And it's like, dude, use a different gun. Yeah. <laughs> Your fucking obsidian doubt loadout doesn't impress me anymore <laughs> after 30 kills. I'm like, all right, man. We're only a quarter of the way through this game. Yeah, you're, you're, uh, you're no scope having M4. Hurts my, me in two bullets. Hurts can, my can, feelings sometimes. It's <laughs> so like, stupid. Why are you here? Pick, go play The Last of Us again. Right. <laughs> I don't know. Pick, buy FIFA. There's other games you can get good at. Yeah, I don't get it. Anyway, what else we got on this list? Need for Speed Heat, $24. That's not enough for you to get that. It's got to be twenty, you know. I don't. Oh my god! I don't mean dude. to be like Chum Lee here, but like it's got to be. I don't want to pay more than twenty dollars. I for actually it. think I'm gonna. Mm. <laughs> Are you contemplating it now? I kind of am. Okay, let's talk pros and cons. Cons. What's the What's the con of Need for Speed Heat right now? Well, I spend twenty four dollars. Twenty. Okay, twenty four dollars <laughs> is the price. Uh, that's a con. What's a pro? Need it's a racing speed. game on that I don't. Is it is it open world? Is I don't it know. is it arcade? You I know nothing know. about. The, you're willing to spend twenty four dollars on an impulse buy. You know <laughs> nothing about <laughs> nothing. Yeah, kind of. I want I want the experience to mirror the first time I played Need for Speed Underground. I want it to be kind of open world, um, semi realistic yeah. place because Need for Speed Underground was in uh, like L A slash Orange County on. Like in in and around near real places, and so that right. was cool. You know what, dude? Let me do some research. <laughs> You're gonna research now? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, dude. Hustle by day and risk it all at night in Need for Speed Heat, a thrilling race experience that pits you against a city's rogue police force as you battle your way into street racing's elite. Online features require an account and are subject to terms of service. Privacy policy. In the game publisher's privacy policy. Um, oh, Dynasty Warriors. You ever played those games? Dynasty Warriors? Yeah. No. It's, um, how do you describe it? I, I, I don't know what it's actually called, like the type of game it is, but you play basically like a general, and your army are, is a bunch of AI grunts that follow you in waves and stuff. Some some type of games, you can move those waves around. Others, you just have to assume command of the general and kind of hack and slash through other just waves of enemy AI. 
Hmm. But you're like this fucking superhero, basically, with this long kung fu staff or superpowers that kills like 30 dudes at a time. Dynasty Warriors? Yeah. Huh. It's one of those things. How much is it? It's 20 bucks. <laughs> okay. All right. That's all right. I might check that out. The Witcher 3, $12? Yeah, I have The you, Witcher. I should play it. You keep saying that. Do you want to borrow it? Yes. Okay. I've said that three times, yeah, and you're like, all right, it. I'll have to find it. Don't buy it. Oh, I well, found it. I found all my games. Everything's organized. I have to clean my house for the first time. All right, dude. Uh, I'll go grab it before we leave. Red Dead 2, if you don't have that yet, it's only $30. That's worth $30. Yeah, that's worth the uh, $60 pay right now. Yeah, still. Yeah. I, I don't know. It is still normally priced at $60. Yeah. I don't know if I could be talked into spending $60 on it now, but like, because I, I understand the value. Well, you have it. So. But for <coughs> someone who's really looking. Stupid. For someone who's looking for it, $30 is a fucking steal. Yeah, absolutely. Like, if you were one of those people that's like, oh, I'll wait till it's on sale. Especially because you know when you buy it and you install it, Rockstar is going to catch you up with a bunch of freebies and they're like, yo, mm-hmm. now you started at level 12. Go. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, the on like if you yeah you play the fucking story mode that's worth sixty dollars in itself, and then you add the online on top of that. Yeah, yeah, it's the reason why um, you're not getting a new Grand Theft Auto because it's too worth it. Right, (laughs) right, right. (laughs) Same with Grand Theft Auto Five. It's like people keep playing it, and they're like, "Well, we'll just keep updating this." Fucking stop playing it, guys. Why the fuck would we dump a bunch of money into a new game? Like (laughs) that's gonna be the last Grand Theft Auto they make. (laughs) It's just gonna continuously update. Yeah, GS. Hey, man. They, they've been nailing it, apparently. But, oh, that was another one of these games on here. Uh, $15 for the premium online edition of Grand Theft Auto V. Hmm. That's in my wheelhouse of impulse buy. I think, I think 20 to $25, I'm like, Don't okay. you figure once you get it for the PS4, you'll be able to play it on the PS5? Or do you think you'll just have the PS4 version? I think you have the PS4 version. Fuck, that's so stupid. Especially because you're not getting... Like, you're getting... That GTA 5 for the PS5. You know, the one we saw that we thought wasn't going to be yeah. GTA 5 again? Yeah. <laughs> Unbelievable. <laughs> Have we talked about this? Uh, on a previous I've watched some reaction videos. It's great. It's unbelievable, man. It is kind of ridiculous. Three generations of video of consoles this has spanned. That's amazing. Whose fault is it, though? Is it us as a consumer? It's nobody's fault. Or is it's it just, them it's as, supply as a and demand. <laughs> so it's the consumer's fault. The business doesn't do it if the if the uh, consumer isn't asking for it most of the time. <clears throat> Minus Whoop. Whoop is doing it. Fucking knocking out of the park. <laughs> yeah, I yeah, don't yeah. know what I want, but apparently you do. Right. You guys are <laughs> fucking killing it. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah, yeah dude. Um, I don't know, man. Yeah, it's like I said, I think it's just supply and demand. Fuck. It's because we're dumb. People are well, I hate it. Yeah. I mean, for <laughs> the most part. Yeah. We're but. all dumb. But if it's good enough, it, it doesn't. It's not like it doesn't make sense that people are still playing it. <clears throat> you know what I mean? Yeah, it totally makes sense. I but, understand why like Red Dead Online kind of dropped off because they kind of stopped updating it. But they're going to release one this summer. Hmm. Um, one of my games that I enjoy recently died. They just like basically stopped hosting servers. Uh, Battleborn. Have you? Did you play no. Battleborn? Very interesting. Um, it, it, it's kind of a. MOBA feeling kind of game where you you play a third person hero. It's like, like League Overwatch. of Legends, more Overwatch, okay. less League of Legends. Yeah, um, right. and you get you you play through missions instead of like there is a PvP mode which is cool. It's three lanes on three lane kind of combat, but there's like the meat of the gameplay are just missions and tasks, and you kind of work as a team to do them quickly. Mm-hmm. And then it's a boss fight, but you do it with different characters. Very unique game, but came out when Overwatch came out. So mm, just got fucking got buried, buried yeah. under everything else. Um, but yeah, they recently, maybe like last month, just <coughs> get done. It. Yeah, oh. it was a good game. One I would recommend. Like I would wake up early in the morning to play. Wow. Yeah. <clears throat> Jonathan and I just started playing this game called Magicka Two, and it's like a, it's like a like a top down kind of deal. But you like prepare spells and then you. The depending on what elements you use for spells and what order you prepare them in, it does different things when you use them. Like alchemy? Sort of. Dude, it's so hard to explain. Like, mm. you just, you kind of have Yo, to Jonathan play finds it. some weird fucking games. He does, like, but dude, they're what did good. You, did you get this at a fucking garage sale? Right, like? but they're good games. It's weird, man. He, uh, Yeah, he, do, he does play weird games, but 
It's a. Uh, it's got an interesting feel, and I I suggest it's only fifteen dollars on the PlayStation hmm. Store. So, yeah, I recommend that game. Did you just by, start playing it by way of Jonathan? By <laughs> through way of Jonathan. Yeah. yeah, he does have good recommendations, but it's just like, how do you just stumble upon these? What do you? But he also what? doesn't want to get Tony Hawk's Pro Skater remastered. So it's we've like, been through this though. It's I just barely, an experience. Re- I barely respect you. He played. He played the <laughs> shitty Tony Hawk's. He played it when yeah. it lost its flavor. Yeah, and. When you go to Panda Express one time and the food sucks, mm. you never go back. I get it. I've never had that. Yeah, it's good. It's, so <laughs> it's good. always it's good. It's always good. I've never <laughs> went to Panda being like, I never should have came here. Yeah, never. I've it's, been to Subway and I went, never, I've never yeah, should have came here. Same. I never regret going. Yeah. I'm, Panda Express. My, when I went to Subway, the dude straight up like made the wrong sandwich, but I'm not the kind of guy that's like, oh, I, I, no, can you redo it? I'm just like, that's fine. It's fine. <laughs> I was like, can I, I, I probably ordered like a chicken teriyaki or something and then he gave me like an italian bmt and it's like it's not like i'm not gonna eat it whatever dude and then Mm. he got the vegetables right and then i said a sauce and he put the wrong sauce what i asked for maybe sweet onion and he gave me like no i asked for mustard and he gave me sriracha and he was like oh it's like a spicy mustard and i was like it's not but (laughs) (laughs) what the fuck dude cool bro um yeah that was the one time i went to subway and i was like i should not have come here i would i would totally been like i don't want that well i didn't think he was gonna fuck it up the entire (laughs) way through i would have stopped it before i would have been like i want you to remake that and i want a discount this is bullshit (laughs) what the fuck did you not hear what i said but it was already down. I didn't want to waste the food. And it's again, it's not like I wasn't going to eat that sandwich. I would have made That's him eat it. I mean, you eat that right now because I don't want that food right. to go to waste. With mustard. Nope. Sriracha. <laughs> it's like I went, can I get this? And he was like, oh, I got a better idea. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's so rude. He's like, you're going to like this better. Trust me. <laughs> I have to now. That's not fair. Fucking so rude. No. Nah, I, I would have told fat. that guy to fuck and right off. And I ate it. Do you have overcooked on your PlayStation? Cause I Why does that play game it. sound familiar? I think I do. I think it's a mobile game originally, but they converted it. But I want to play it, but I don't want to play it alone. Because it's weird when you try to solo that game. Hmm. It doesn't make sense. I feel like I do. I check my library. All I've right. had to delete many a thing. Over it was one of the free games once upon a time. Probably got it. <laughs> it's great. We should play it together. I just get it um, to have the license sometimes i get it and i delete it right 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 that makes sense but yeah. farm simulator i was on that shit dude okay? that's so sad i sat down i was like you know what i have two hours i'm gonna learn how to play this game i learned how to play it terrible game yeah so brian bad. matthews is deep into it dude so bad he's like you gotta be like a task oriented kind of person like do this cool go do that cool do that cool i'm <laughs> i'm too much like hey what's over here What's right, over here? Right. What's that? Oh, and can it, I use that, this? And that doesn't pay off in that game? No, not at all. <laughs> in fact, it causes more problems because you're like, hey, man, all of your machines are done working. Do you want to do something? Oh, yeah. Sorry. I was by the creek hanging out. Like, <laughs> I was seeing if I could fish. Yeah. So, you know what? I got stuck in this rock slash creek because I thought I could go past the level barrier, but I can't. Now I'm stuck. You're so dumb. Who plays that game like that? I don't know, but enough people where they have 20... 20 fucking farming simulator games. I played 19. I feel robbed. But I'm glad I experienced it. Are you sure that isn't just the year? No, no. It can't be because I think 20 (laughs) just came out. Regardless, they still come out. (laughs) They've come out for the last 10 years. This is PlayStation 2 graphics. Really? It's It's not even realistic. PlayStation 2. Like I feel like I'm you playing. You press triangle to go back. Kind of. <laughs> do you remember that? Yeah. Isn't it weird that they made that switch? Yeah. Why did they do that? I think that was a Midnight Club thing. What? Yeah, I think Midnight Club started that whole triangle reverse thing, right? No, like to go back, like you, like just on like the UI, like PlayStation, like if you hit start and you're like, I want to back out of this, you would oh. always hit triangle. Yeah. Exit that was, was always triangle. Was PlayStation One. You're and right. And then PS3, I think they changed it to circle rude it's weird i don't know why that like maybe it was midnight club or they i don't know no like, that doesn't make sense but because hmm. that's what xbox was b to go back yeah you know what what change they did make that i don't like because i don't like the start and select button that is share 
Yeah, share yeah. And options. It's like that. Yeah. I'm you're fighting 3 decades of programming right now. You're going to lose. I know. Stop it. <laughs> I don't like it. But it makes sense. To uh, when you play it, yes, it makes sense, but like when other people pick it up like my girlfriend, I'm like press options and she's like what button is options? Oh, I always hit I always say start. I've had to start telling her that. I always say hit start. Hit select. Yeah, no. I Where's see. select next to the bigger button? I know it doesn't make sense. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> the ergonomically, yeah. it makes sense, but all the buttons, except the new the new controller looks dope. I'm really yeah. excited for that. Yeah, I like it. The haptic feedback on the triggers. That'll be fun. Super stoked. Okay, what else is on this? I don't know. I've Anything to, catch your eye yet? I had to find a new game uh, site because it crashed. Crash Bandicoot trilogy, twenty bucks. Days Gone for $27 if you are into zombies and haven't played that. Like a lot of sports games are only like 12 bucks. Madden 20, FIFA 20. The show was 20 bucks or 30 bucks. That's kind of. Mm. You got the, the fancy edition though, didn't you? Last time, yeah. But this is the new one. Oh. That was last year. That's the thing that's shitty about sports games. It's like you could get, like, I bought like the fancy one for that year and then. For not. <laughs> yeah, kind of. New game. It's weird. Mortal Kombat, dude. Every time that goes on sale, I, I I think about playing it. I've never been good, but I just enjoy picking I it up. It. I don't like combination shit. Yeah? Yeah, I'm not a fan. It's mm. like, I don't want to memorize your move list, dude. I guess. It's well, you gotta, you gotta stupid. You got to pick a main and then yeah, spam but, that shit. But like, if you're just playing with like... A friend? Yeah. The new ones, though, there's a, there's always a point where it just gets hard, like difficult. Like, you're like, I can't get past this. Yeah. Yeah. So, but uh, Tekken doesn't ever reach that point. So, it's great. That's a good one to pick up. If, really? You just <laughs> yeah. keep whooping people's asses? No, it gets harder and longer to whip people's asses. Yeah. But eventually, as long as you're not just Hoot! grab, 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 mm. grab, you're, it's fun. The Witcher 3, Last of Us. Last of Us was a good game. I'm I'm sleeping. I got to borrow. Do you know anyone with the second one? Do I know anything about it? Do you know anyone with it? Uh, or do I have to ask? Yeah. I gotta, yeah, I do. I got to play it. <laughs> oh, I don't know about a physical copy. <clears throat> Ooh, Horizon Zero Dawn for $15. Dollars. Yeah, I hear that game's good. It's I, like an open world RPG kind of, right? Yeah, <clears throat> yeah, like a... Post post apocalyptic, like in the future, and then after that future happens right, already. <laughs> right. Uh, it was a good. I I watched a lot of the videos. It looked beautiful as a game in general. Fucking. Middle Middle Earth, Shadow of War, thirteen dollars. Hmm. I've heard those games are really good. Like the Lord of the Rings. Yeah, games. I, I'm thinking if I can spend less than fifteen dollars. Yeah, I guess that's a good impulse buy. I am looking for new shit, you know, like the timing of this sale in general. Tekken 7, $10. Yeah, Tekken looks dope. <laughs> they had a trailer with like... Uh, You're going to get it. One of their characters versus another character from Street Fighter. And I'm like, I'm in. This is dope. <laughs> <laughs> you, yep. you got me. I'm in. Oh, hey, Red Dead Ultimate Edition is only $35. So you might as well spend the extra $5 and get that, whatever yeah, that for gets sure. you. I don't know for what sure. that gets you, but... And 20 extra gold bars. Maybe. I recommend that. Battlefield 5? Yeah, that's I saw a, that. That's a de- yeah. decent throwdown for a second. NHL 20, $12, dude. All dude. these EA sports games, $20. Yeah, all right. Stay with me on this. Okay. Like, this is a game. Okay? Look. <laughs> all right, I'm going to hate it. Go no, ahead. No, no, no. I, hate is such a strong word for a I'm gonna game. Hate, I'm gonna hate this game's going to give you so much just joy of like, you know, just, you know, that feeling of living the American dream or that white house, white picket fence, white people. Just the American dream. You can play a uh, bus simulator <laughs> and go to your regular nine to five, pick up other people's. I would rather little, play farming simulator. Little pieces of shit and take. What a shitty job to say that, hey, Dude. we need to simulate this game. It's like they're turning Roblox into like a real game. You yeah. Know? I might play it and give you a report. Wait, how much are you going to spend on it? $25. No, you're not. Dude. Dude, if you spend $25 on that game and don't 
get something else instead. <laughs> <laughs> That's so stupid. That is the most irresponsible. Our, our thing. next our next podcast is gonna be me reviewing this game. Like I understand if it's one of the free games, like the farming simulator was. All right, all right, all right. Would you be okay with me spending eighteen dollars on this game? No, no? I would no. All if right. you get that ten dollar credit that supposedly PlayStation has given out to their PlayStation Plus members, yeah, I'm fucking what happened? I didn't get that. I didn't get it either. But anyway, maybe they're still rolling it out. Fucking like stimulus, like a checks. stimulus. Check. <laughs> they're gonna give you a. We mailed cards out. We just had to make sure our PlayStation yeah. name was on it. Right, right, right. Um. I no. forget what I was saying. Fucking, I could oh, play. Oh, then you'd be like fifteen dollars. Then I'd be like, I mean, okay, but as long as you get like another twelve dollar game, that's like, reasonable. Like staying in this path of the American dream, especially in Southern California, for eighteen dollars, I can play Car Mechanic Simulator. That I would rather you get that. <laughs> that might be educational, actually. I know that's exactly what I said <laughs> when you when you mentioned it to me. I was like, I could probably yeah. actually. do Is there a setting that. for two thousand seven Scion? <laughs> <laughs> dude that would be dope if you could <laughs> plug in any car that would be dope there was a game um it might have been called monster hunter actually monster rancher what it was an anime game i played it on playstation one monster rancher sounds like an npc in a dnd game <laughs> a monster rancher yeah hey, girl these monsters for the <laughs> bad guy so <laughs> i got i got two dragons uh, a boar and a couple of ox. And these kobolds I just keep around and do my work. My this, is, work. this is my house elf. <laughs> um, what was it? Monster Rancher. It was a game for the PlayStation 1. It was based on an anime that uh, it was like Pokemon. You had monsters. You built relationships with them and you fought them or they yeah. defended you. Um, but in the game on PlayStation, it was the first that I knew of that they would allow you to open the disc tray while you were playing. Like, Obviously, when the disc wasn't being read, now that I think about this. But you op- you would play the game, and there would be certain instances where you could open the disc tray and get any CD in your collection and put it in, and it would read the CD, and it would generate a monster from that disc. Wait, what? PlayStation 1. What the fuck? Yeah, it was fucking dope, dude. That, and were the monsters different? Yeah. yeah Based they on would... the CD? Yeah, yeah. So, like, they would have... Obviously, like just a general structure, a general amount of uh, monsters that would get generated, and obviously some would be rarer than others. But there would be little differences depending on the disc that you use. Some some kind of algorithm read the disc somehow, where it would generate some kind of unique. So it basically took the the data from the disc and converted it into a an, or a monster a skin, creator. Almost. Yeah, 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 yeah. And that is would, fascinating. You would get different monsters. And so my mom would get mad at me because I would play this game and just have stacks of CDs, <laughs> just random CDs of hers. Like I start, And that was part of it. Like that was yeah, yeah, yeah. the but, point of it. Because in Monster Rancher, what the uh, character had to do um, was find these stone tablet discs. Like they would probably be the size of maybe a medium pizza. And then he'd have to take it, it's it's a it's a it's a MacGuffin. You'd have to he'd have to take that. He'd have to find that thing, take that thing to a certain place. He, they uh, in the show, I think, reincarnate a monster. It would be like a, it would contain a monster's soul, and that's how you got it. You freed them that way, and so that's what you were doing with the discs, as you were generating your monster in the PlayStation. Then you could use that monster to then battle other monsters. It was dope. That's amazing. That's a great concept. <laughs> That's really fun. <laughs> yeah, it was. I had a fucking great time with that. That's game. cool. Um, but I'm still in. I might get Bus Simulator. Okay, <laughs> shut up. No, you won't. <laughs> you will not do that. Um, I refuse. Crash Team Racing, Nitro Fueled. I told you this is a great Mario Kart replacement, folks. If you are uh, looking for a game for twenty four dollars, um, they don't really have another kind of kart racing game for PlayStation that I I would recommend as a second so kart think, racing kart race, like, like a, mario like, kart mm. i think the crash bandicoot racing <laughs> yeah so i'm saying like crash team racing you can get that on sale right now that's okay. a great game the that's only good. the only downside i think i've mentioned this before is for some reason a old playstation 3 game has very long load times in a playstation 4 mm. like because they remastered everything oh right right so right. it's like no this should load faster than the original i mean unless they really it loads the same, if not longer. <laughs> and I'm like, <laughs> I've checked out already. I don't want to race six times in a row. Right, right. So, Death Stranding. I've heard very good things, but I'm not 
anything that I'm going to pay $36 I, I, for. I don't know, man. People are like, oh, it's great. And then I'm like, oh, like, what do you do? And they're like, well, you just kind of like. You're a mailman? Deliver shit. I'm like. W- it sounds like you talked to Jonathan about this what? game. <laughs> this sounds boring as fuck. No, that's like everybody that I hear. Like any kind of review that I read, it's just like, yeah, you you make deliveries to for something. And I'm like, this that doesn't sound fun at all. <laughs> Nothing about it sounds fun. They're like, you can build ladders and you can and it'll help other players. And I'm like, okay. And like Meanwhile, Do you, you steal their, you're their, playing their supply? A, you're or? playing a game as a magical flag in a sand dune <laughs> for no reason. Dude, that game's cool though. <laughs> it is cool. Dirt Rally's on this list. Um, I don't know if you're I think it's personal choice if you're willing to spend fourteen dollars on But I dirt. have Dirt Two Rally. Yeah, so I'm saying. Oh, what did I say too? It's Dirt Rally Two. You can. Oh. If you didn't, oh. if you missed it for free, not everyone's paying. You should. I don't know why you're not. If you're not getting, if you're not at least like you said, getting the licenses for the games, for the free games, like what are you doing? Yeah. You're wasting your PlayStation Plus membership because those alone are worth the the cost, well over the cost. Gran Turismo's on sale. Wow. Wow. What, that one, that one kind of. Uh, Went in on the right ra- under the radar for a second. Those I feel like those they, usually they get overshadowed by Need for Speed. Probably Heat, Jump Force. Jump Force is uh their anime. What's Jump Force? They they take all of their their anime characters and all their shonen manga characters and they make them fight. Oh, like, like Super Smash Brothers. But That's with fun. Anime people. I don't know how the controls are. Uh, here's Kingdom Hearts three. Still too much to pay for it. Um, you can pay eighteen dollars for Kingdom Hearts three, or pay for the Kingdom Hearts All in One package. You know what's funny? For twenty nine is, is you think eighteen dollars for Kingdom Hearts three is too much. Yep. But you'd pay for Bus Simulator for twenty four dollars. It's simulating real life. So stupid, dude. I am inside. You I know, can't. I am looking for things. I can't to tell do. you how angry. I'm gonna pick up right Xerox now. Machine three. <laughs> I'm so upset right now. <laughs> I'm going to pick up Water Fountain Installer Sim 9000. You know what's actually a good sim game is Flight Simulator. Um, Yeah. That one actually has, if you're especially if you're actually thinking about flying, I feel yeah. like it's useful. They actually use that. Um, let's see. I'm looking for another like Monster Hunter game, but they're not there. I guess you got to pay full price for Monster Hunter, guys. Sorry. Sorry, my bad. Not like I make a fucking decision. If you don't have Overcooked, you can get it right now for six seventy nine. Dude, I'll go through like Amazon Prime Video and be like, "Oh, I want to watch that. Four dollars, perfect." <laughs> Whatever. I fucking hate that. Whatever. Why are you showing me these movies that I have to pay extra after <laughs> I pay for Amazon Prime? And get out of here. So what's the? How come I see Dirt Four, but then there's Dirt Rally Two? Because it's all also just um, like a super cross game as well, whereas like dirt rallies all in the mountains. Hmm. You know, you get stretch of road, but like dirt, you get dirt, <laughs> fucking asphalt, gravel, more. Hmm. What's the word? More paved X surfaces. Gamey? Yeah, kind of. I think I prefer that like one. Like Conas and stuff. It's only five dollars. All right, fine. I'm down. <laughs> Whoa, dude. Tomb you can get Spyro, the Spyro trilogy and the Crash trilogy for $37.49. Ooh, that's a steal. That is a good that's deal. That's a good meal. Good meal. Good, good meal. meal. You're hungry. <laughs> Star Wars for 30 I might pick that up. Really? Yeah. I'll come watch you play. I'll share play. I it. like can... the lore. I enjoy it. Yeah, I get that. I'll I'll watch you play it through share play. <laughs> Not even come over. Just no. like, yo, stream that shit, homie. <laughs> World War Z had a game, and for $12, I've let always, me know how it is. I've always wondered how that is. It's probably like, just another, like, look, wave of zombies, shoot at them, set traps, survive. Probably. Move to different area, do I'd, again. I'd rather it be, like, a telltale game, like, you just play through the movie because the movie was dope. Yeah. Brad nothing, Pitt. Nothing like the book. Really? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
just like names of characters and like the general oh, yeah. the general idea of what's going on. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, all right. They just got it off. I guess. They were probably like, yo, if we don't use this this month, we're gonna lose the license. Just put it on Pump something. It out. <laughs> Pump it out. Zombies? Cool. We'll put Brad Pitt on it. They won't even notice. And we didn't. <laughs> we didn't. It was a cool movie. It was a cool movie. Those are some scary fucking zombies. It was good. And it had a good like what do you call it? Like hook? With like why or like how to defeat them. Oh. It was like out of the ordinary. Yeah. For zombies. Yeah. Very. Um. Who else did some kind of similar ending? Um. War of the Worlds. Right. Where at the end they were like, oh, they couldn't drink the water because they were parasites. <laughs> You're like, hang on. That's how we beat the aliens. Was that what it was? Yeah. Huh. Because there were because we had evolved on the planet. These aliens had invaded and didn't develop the necessary antibodies and pathogens. So to we fight. just got lucky. Yeah. Huh. We didn't even win. They were just like, oh, this planet sucks. Have you read that book? No. I wonder if the ending is the same. Probably. I mean, that's a cool ending. You think so? Yeah. That's Orwell, right? Yes. God damn. If you haven't read 1984, now's the fucking time to do it, dude. Yeah, it's oddly, if you can look past the um, obvious misses in technology. Yeah, but. Because hindsight is 2020. You, but you, you can't predict that shit. Yeah. But goddamn, you know? Pretty close. Pretty close. Especially in like this digital age of like scrubbing information and, yep. you know. But like, he really, he really wasn't off because like those. I forget what he calls them, like, but those devices that they put in the homes to like record shit and whatever. Yeah, like no, not the device. Like everything recorded shit. The the screen that you looked at watched your gestures, but there was just like a specific range on those things. But like he he could hide from it. Yeah, that was weird. You know, it's a paparazzi scarf, bro. Yeah. So personal EMP. But like with like Alexa. Or like Apple, like they have a home device. It's like I mean, with mm. your phone now. <clears throat> yeah, even that. I mean, tell me it's not just a device that sits and is just there, and it just record, it just listens to what you're saying. You yeah. know, I didn't it's know exactly what we have. I didn't know that I was allowing apps um, to just read my clipboard. <laughs> I had no idea. <laughs> That's weird. Yeah, but like most of them will just read what you just googled basically right because you you know copy paste <laughs> yeah and then you're like oh now that's all i see on everything mm, that makes sense yeah. <laughs> yeah and i allowed that <laughs> i'm like fuck dude that's scary it kind of is it's scary it's scary that but it's also awesome at the same time it is because you're like so oh cool. i didn't know that i needed that yeah yeah I, I, I like I like it, but I I see the I understand the appre apprehensiveness, apprehension, apprehension. Yes, yeah. thank you. I agree. Yeah, I like I my word better, but yeah, it's that's not the a proper word. word. Well, my I mean, <laughs> it is now, and it's better. So yeah, I think we we just need to be aware. You know, I think there's a, there is a lot of people that use these devices that. Or like, well, I have nothing to hide, or they would never do that when just assume because they can, they are. But it's, yeah. Because you yeah. can, they will. Right. Like, there's no reason to think otherwise. Nothing and has ever said otherwise. You definitely don't, even if you're not doing anything wrong, like, you don't need your personal life, like, recorded like that. Yeah. Or like, um, plus, especially now, they can just edit things and put them in weird orders and make you look bad. Yeah. If they need to. It's scary with what we can do just with filters on a fucking app. Like how I can replace my face and make someone else say something. Yeah. That's weird. <laughs> That's weird. Then, did you not say this? I don't remember. And that was like, yeah, right? Like you say so much. Like yeah. you can't be like, oh shit, did I say that? Yeah. I was, was I there on that day? I might have. Or like those, what are they, deep fake? Yeah. Those videos, like, it's like, oh my God. Yeah. The world is over, basically. <laughs> like, <laughs> Mark Zuckerberg will never die because he'll just, like, he only do video conferences. Dude, he put, like, fondant on his face when he went surfing. Did you see that? No. He put on, like, 
too much sunscreen or maybe like a too much of a water activated sunscreen where he looked like he was doing white face hilarious like, what are you doing then again he's a coder he, and he's probably hella pale and he's, he's like, super he's gotta he be he can't get liquid sunscreen for him he's, he's got like yeah it needs to come out of a mayo jar he's whiter than me <laughs> for sure it's translucent yeah scary um he has all our information you should get for ten dollars ski jumping pro vr i feel like i need the move controllers don't that. tell me that would be dope maybe that would be dope there's plenty of games i would have bought but the move controllers were impossible to find that's so annoying yeah yeah impossible that's so weird until maybe a month ago oh did, so. you, did you get something no 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 why, why, why? because why? playstation's right there oh my god i can't be just spending well, you're money, gonna bro. be using your vr with the ps5 but I, they might come out with a newer version. Of oh, and you're gonna get. Controls. Oh, all yeah. right, that's fair. Yeah. And you're, I was, I thought you were gonna I'm say not gonna a new spend, VR. Yeah, if I can wait and then spend forty five more dollars for a newer version of those controllers, I'm in. Though, if they give me a pod race simulator or an X wing simulator, and they want to put the VR headset in a helmet. And sell it as like a special edition and give you stickers and maybe like a rebel patch you can iron on somewhere. I might do that. What the fuck, dude? I'm just I don't shoelaces. <laughs> you want some shoelaces too? Dude, I have lighted. Maybe shoes. like some some paper that has a nice border of the Dude, if you put it in you put the game in a tin can, I'm sold. Like, <laughs> <laughs> like oh, this is metal? Yeah, that's what I liked about the MLB <sighs> game I got. I was like, ooh. This yeah. Is- See, and nice. like that's kind of I miss those like buyings of the game experiences I had as a kid. Like I buy Game Boy games, but I couldn't play it until I got home because I had to leave my Game Boy at home because it's a hundred dollar piece that I'm gonna leave somewhere because I'm <laughs> six. <laughs> so like I would sit in the car, I'd open the Game Boy game, I'd read through the manual, I'd smell it. They always had a very specific smell. That's weird. I never. I mean, oh. I I would I I remember the scent, but I was never like. You knew you, you didn't have to. You opened it and you smelled it. Especially a new Pokemon book. It was like clean, freshly pressed. I know the scent, but did you sm- like pull put it to your face and smell it? Dude, if I had a candle like that, I would. <laughs> Dude, someone someone fresh, find me that smell. I don't fresh know what it video is. game scent candle. Yeah, that what would is, be awesome. What does that smell? Tell if, me what that if, fucking if smell that is. That wouldn't be sold on GameStop.com. <laughs> I don't know what would. Dude, they're selling like uh, Pirates of the Caribbean. Sm- ride smell it's basically that dirty water smell but so many well, people never associate what what dude i'll take Sorry, you dude, i'm poor you can I'll, I'll make you my girlfriend for a week we'll go all right let's we'll go. go let's fucking rage all right dude let's go we'll rage <laughs> we'll go build lightsabers well we'll build droids uh, i mean daddy can carry you We'll take a helicopter. What? <laughs> <laughs> you had me, dude. You had me. <laughs> Where else are we going? <laughs> we go to a steakhouse later, too. It's probably You know what, dude? Here. We need to get sushi. Yes. I'm down. I don't. Yeah. Well, I would prefer dine. And we need an outdoor dining sushi. Yeah, we'll fuck up some sushi, dude. Dude. Oh, yeah. I need you to tell me what's good. Okay. I'll just order a gang of shit and be like, here, try these. Okay. And you eat what you like. Yeah. And then from there, we go a second time. Like, all right, you order now. Oh, God. And then, now you're making me nervous. Yeah. I'm getting anxiety. This is how you talk a girl into two dates. You make an experience. <laughs> a two-parter. You're like, first I do it, then you do it. You're an asshole. Sushi's good, though. That's a good one. It's healthy. Sushi's relatively healthy. I mean, minus all the rice. The rice just fills yeah. you up, though. That's that's right. that's fucking rude. They're like, hey, how thin can we slice this fish that you'll still pay $6 a plate for? It? It's so ridiculous. Fucking assholes. Sushi's down. Um, they have a game on, on a mobile where you can make sushi. <laughs> what, why? Because it's, it's, it's like a one of those Cooking Mama games. Cooking Mama? Yeah. What Just is like that? You pick, you get ingredients, you have to get them in a specific order, and, and it's in a certain amount of time. So, you know, you start out with two plates in 10 seconds, and then it just keeps ramping up faster. That's kind of what, like, Overcooked is like. Uh, I, I Then I definitely played that. 
If where I it's like, correctly. here's these things that you have to prepare, and like you have a kitchen, mm-hmm. and it, it's you know it has different obstacles. Yeah. Have you and ever it, worked in a kitchen? No. 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 I mean, I worked at the improv, but I've never worked at the kitchen. Mm-hmm. I mean, I've been in there, but I don't know what's going on. I just kind of stand around. It's a pretty good gig. It's a good job, though, to work in a kitchen. I think I think restaurant in general, because it's hospitality, it kind of puts you at a certain class of person, I guess. Mm. But in the kitchen, um, going from everyone loving you to everyone hating you in like 10 minutes mm. is... I think people need to experience that because mm-hmm. <laughs> some people don't. Everything's all hunky dory until you have to make twelve fucking plates in right. six minutes now because that server did something bad. It's fun, but it's uh-huh. high pressure. And those games kind of that do something real quick. It's hard to recreate, but those games do it. It's yeah, yeah, borderline addicting. You're like, why do I enjoy this? Right, right. <laughs> There's no You're happy all ending. Anxious to this. and yeah. yeah. <laughs> Every night after closing a restaurant, I'm like, this is, I'm not happy. Right. Like, I'm, I'm glad it's over. Mm-hmm. I'm not happy it's done. <laughs> right. You want to work in my kitchen? No. No? Shit. No, I'm good. I don't think I would be good at it. I just like food. It's yeah, a, me too. I don't know. It's When I'm cooking, no one else is there, so you can't judge me by how much I'm eating while I'm cooking. <laughs> It's He's like putting raw chicken. I in your have mouth. to sample thirty <laughs> times. I, I add a little salt. Did it affect the flavor? Obviously not, because it wasn't enough. But <laughs> I have to know that for sure. So uh, good to know. Those cooking calories. You're I gonna, always say they don't count. You're gonna coronavirus my meal when you make it. No, it's still cooking. I take it like in a spoon or a toothpick. Yeah, classy like Gordon Ramsay. It's adorable. I don't want him to make me an idiot sandwich. Have you seen that? No. He's holding up the bread between some bitch's face, but on both sides of her ears. He's like, what are you? And she's like an idiot sandwich chef. Oh, my God. <laughs> How do you get that job? What That's an what I want. animal, dude. They're like, why do you want to be a chef? He's like, because I want to <laughs> yell at people. <laughs> That's why. Have you read um, Anthony Bourdain's uh, No Reservation? No. Uh, Kitchen Confidential. It's good. That you should read, and then you don't have to work in a kitchen. Oh, cool. It's a good skit. I, I mean, I, He's a great writer. <laughs> fucking people sleep on him, I feel like. I don't think I need to read that to not want to work in a kitchen. <laughs> it's actually the opposite. I've, every time I read it, I'm like, fuck, I miss it. That's weird. He, he has a really... He's charming in his writing that, like, mm. it seem, it's very cool to be kind of a degenerate. Huh. It's very Maybe at his level. attractive. No, because even in like he talks about working in a kitchen like his first night, just being too young, too small for that kitchen, not mm-hmm. able to handle the heat, literally, because it's hot and it's like the fucking 60s. Yeah. So um, how it sucks and how he grabbed like pans and shit like he just wasn't there for it. And that was basically his whole career of like in a kitchen like he out of place all the time like mm. just never really excelling until a certain person gave him a shot but interesting seems very attractive to like bang a, wa- a, a fucking bride on her wedding night outside by the dumpster because you're serving her like wait he did that his coworker did his sous chef uh, maybe oh. i the, from the way it's written real talk like i think he did it like, he, <laughs> he's just saying someone else did it just to save his ass yeah it's like, oh, uh, a friend of mine once fucked a girl. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, all right, piece. He gives of shit. all these details. It's yeah. like, how do you know? Yeah, all her this? fingernails were red. <laughs> <laughs> Slow it down. All right. Um, I have no more games to talk about. No, nah, I went through the whole list, and we pretty much hit the big ones. Yeah, there's a handful of good games, though. Realistically, in fair prices, no outrageous asks. Uh, minus Star Wars. Yeah, it's a little bit much. But again, that again, that's contractual. <laughs> probably. <laughs> probably. Fucking Disney. I'll probably get one of those sports games, dude. I want to get... Problem is, I want a FIFA game, but I also want the new NHL game at the same time. Mm. Go NHL, wait for Black Friday, FIFA. Like $12. I could do the opposite, though, too. Flip a coin. <laughs> 
flip a coin, and then when your your heart will tell you while it's in midair what which you really one do you want. want? Yeah. yeah, yeah. I mean, I already do have an NHL game, so it's last year's, hmm. so it's not like it's old. FIFA, it is. Probably FIFA. One of those third world $12. countries. Twelve dollars. Hopefully, I get that ten dollar credit. How do you get that? I don't know. I just saw. It. I don't know. It just looked like you got a notification. I don't know. It almost looked like a scary link, like too good to be true. So yeah, I'm not touch it. I'll uh, I'll have to do some more research. <laughs> we'll figure it out. We'll report back. Yeah. All right. Well, that's the list. That's our summer sale event. I'm sure there's going to be sales all quarantine, all lockdown. Yeah. And then you know Black Friday, PlayStation. So we're gonna you're gonna save a lot of money and spend a lot of money. How freaking exciting! Um, thanks for listening, guys. I am at the George F. Where are you at? At the underscore Slim Henderson on Instagram, at the Slim Henderson on Instagram, because the underscore is too long. Dumb, dumb. I know. Blame Twitter. Fuck you, Twitter. Yeah. No, no, fuck you. I want a check mark. That seems cool. <laughs> um, but yeah, follow us. Uh, our website gets updated regularly, so go to thebuddysystem.co for everything that's happening. When you know it, we'll know it. We'll see you there. Bye. Adoken. Adoken.